Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in Lumion 10. I am architect Sonurai from Glad Studio and in this today video tutorial, I am going to teach you how to place trees and people in our scene and how to use mass move tool for people. So now I am going to my object here and you can see this is the symbol of trees which is named as nature and you can see the next one is fine detail nature which is added in advanced version of Lumion like Lumion 10, 11 and 12. So if I am going to click on this nature, you can see these are the broad leaf trees here you can see there are almost 13 pages of broad leaf here you can select any of this and you can place start placing these trees here suppose if i am going to place this acacia i will simply click on to this and i will start placing as per my requirement here and you can use this scale here to scale these trees you can see this symbol of trees here and you can increase and decrease the sizes here also and you can do this from this side chart also you can increase the size and de decrease also so this is the function of this so now if i am going to this other types of trees you can simply press on to this and you can start mopping also you can simply press this select button here and you can press alt on your keyboard and you can start mopping this see the distance is also coming how much distance you want likewise you can use this and you can also delete this by using this delete button and simply bring your uh, mouse nearer to the symbol and you can click on that tree and that tree will be deleted so likewise you can use different varieties of trees here you can use this conifers also there are conifers trees you can simply use the same techniques of placing trees And there are some palm tree also there are some palm trees and there are some leafless trees here and there are some grasses here grass types and you can see some plants also here there are various types of plants and there are various types of flowers you can start placing flowers in your scene like this and you can increase or decrease the scale from here so likewise you can use this cactus also and you can use clusters also suppose these are clusters you can use as a cluster suppose i want to use this as a cluster here i will show you i want to populate this scene so i will use cluster here you can use to so your field of vision you can start using these clusters you can increase or decrease the scale size here so likewise you can use this cluster and next is this is our leaf so if you want to show some leaves on your road suppose i want to show some leaves i will select this that type of leaf and i will simply bring onto this road and you can see it will give some more realistic look to your scene so next is these are the forest wood you can use this forest wood also and these all are rocks you can use small boulders in your scene also or landscape design any type of your project you can use these seeds so this was the brief information and you can see this is the star shape as a favorites so if you want to set any of your trees as a favorite or your plants you can simply click on to that and you can simply bring to that box and you can click this star here and it will be set as your favorite so if you want to use again you can go to favorites and you can use that trees so this is the function of placing trees you can also use for interior scene so now i am going to 
people here so i will go to this symbol here people and animals and if i will click this you can see there are main 3d here you can see there are various types of mains so you can use them and you can use for various things like this swimming guy and this resting guys so if i am going to select this man you can see this is animated character here and if you want to use as the animation you can use this type of people and if i will place another guy here i will use this guy and you can animate this i will tell you how we can do this so i am going to next here these all are women 3d here you can use them in your scene so suppose this woman is walking here so i will select this any of the woman i am going to use this woman here and suppose this this is scene of a park you can use this so now i will use this another so now uh, you if you go you can find boys also there are some boys here you can use boys also and you can use some boys here and there are some girls also you can go to next and we can find these girls here next you can see some pets here if you want to use pets you can also use pets and you can use this cat or this dog here next there are some boards so if you want to use boards in your scene you can use this so suppose if i want to use this sparrow here sparrow flying you can use and place any height anywhere and you can click n number to populate and you can also use ducks flying you can place anywhere in your scene so now you can see these all are fine here so next is farm animals so if you want to use farm animals also you can use and these all are people to be is all a 2d people you cannot animate and there are marine life also you can use and this is all of people's 3d see lot i will tell you what is the use of this so now i am going to use mass move tool so now you are required to animate the scene so if i am going to animate these people so i am i am going to first create a movie scene here i will click on the movie here and i will go to i will delete this and i will create a new movie here and i will do scene here first these are the people here so now I am going to click on my first screen and this is my first slide here and I will click on the next slide here so you can easily come to this so now click on the next movie scene here and suppose if you have created three sides you can click on save clip and go back to movie mode now if i am playing here you cannot see these people are moving at the same place so it's not looking that much realistic so what we'll do i will bring this slide back here and now i am going to this effects here add effect button here we'll click this and after this you will go to animation here 
and you can use this mass move tool here I will click on this mass move tool and after this you will see this pencil icon and click on edit and suppose I want this man to go from this way to that way simply you can now you can place anywhere and if you want to uh, move this person to left you can simply click control and with the left mouse in this direction and if you will see here I will press control and I will simply move this and till here and you can uh, increase the path width of this man and you can also increase the model speed here so now I am going to press here and now you can see this man will be moving and you can see this man is going to that direction so uh, same you can repeat for other also so if I am going to edit again this map tool mass move tool you can see uh, there is a button here add path so I am going to add path so I am going to add a path for this guy here so I will in this guy path here I will move this Y to this direction and same you can increase or decrease the speed and same I am going to add path for this lady and that lady will go in the same direction you can turn to any direction with the left mouse click and pressing control you can change the direction here so suppose that if I am clicking once here and control and you can in the direction with the left mouse click and you can increase the path width and increase so again you can do this girl path you can add some path and you can change the direction of this girl And now you can again add some path for this man here and you can change the direction so now you can increase or decrease the path width so now I'm going to finish this and you can see that man is going to that direction and that boy is also in that direction so we'll do for this woman also so this movement is not animated that means and can delete this path for this girl going to add path for this girl I will just show you and you can finish this so this girl is not animating because it's not animated character is standing but all others are moving this movement is also not animation character so likewise you can use this all animated character in your scene using mass move too so this was the tutorial for the today's session in the next session i will come with some more interesting topics in moment 10 so thanks for watching bye bye